All right, as I was doing this course, I put this specific slide here and the old famous spit take. And that is because if you have been paying attention, you realize that when you see lesson summary, you know that we are at the end of this lesson, all right? So to summarize real quick to remember that a house is a very complex building. It is not just a roof and walls and the foundation. There is more to that. Each component has subcomponents and there are very special verbiage. If you ever decide you want to get into being that agent that helps that buyer do uh, brand new build homes, that is great and I would encourage that. I would also encourage you to seek outside further education dealing with specifically the structure of the home so that you can have conversations with the builder as to what is meant by the drip edge and the gable end and you know is it a pillar footing or is it a uh, block and brick footing all of these things that you would need to understand once again don't forget we have this thing called the cfo because each house must pass some regular uh, rigorous inspection before it can go from the builder to the first homeowner and they use this thing called a certificate of occupancy now what I encourage you to do is re review the handout and familiar yourself or familiarize yourself with the different styles of home that we sell in the real estate world one of the fun things that could, you could do is search through the MLS system and see if you can find a style of each one of those homes. <clears throat> that would give you great familiarity and the ability to learn to recognize a home so that when you market that home, you can market it correctly as a Victorian or a stick belt or a ranch or whatever it tends to be, all right? Now, before we get out of here, let me, let's talk a few last things here. Uh, I want to thank you, first of all, for showing up. Now, you have completed your 30 hours of post-licensing. Now, it's very important that you submit your certificate to the state, all right? So here you are. You've got to submit that certificate to the state, and you want to send it to the Real Estate Commission. Real University does not have the ability to submit your certificate to the state for you, all right? So once you're done here, your course will be in the completed area of your dashboard. From there, you can print your certificate or under my account, you have a section entitled certificates. It would be in there. You are now done. The thing that you want to hear is there is absolutely no test for this course. So you have been punished enough by listening to me for 30 hours, all right? So if you have any email or any questions, I once again encourage you to email me. I've given my email several different times. If you have any comments, you can send them directly to me at that same email. Once again, I would ask you a favor if you would go out to Facebook and like Real University or subscribe on our YouTube channel or better yet, go out and give us a review on Trustpilot or Google either way. At this point, I think we are done. I thank you for the 30 hours and invite you to attend our classes that will be coming up. We have continuing ed, which will be due your next license cycle. So feel free to start checking out our continuing education courses, which can be given online. They can be given live. And we also now do streaming live if you want to attend a live course, but don't want to make the drive. At this point, I'm going to say adios and farewell and have a good day. And thank you very much.